on va faire notre super truc. Hi everyone, this is Chewy, and I'm back for my second video for Yard League of Legends. I will still play Ash on this video. Um, I had this video in my uh, computer, and I thought that uh, in my first video it was good, but it didn't show you how Ash can become powerful, very powerful, and uh, this one has a more complete build, so it will uh, it will be better to show you uh, how to build Ash completely, because uh, the game lasts longer than the first one. Ils ont pas de perso qui font peur. Uh, so waiting for it to begin. Le moi que moi il me fait peur. This time I'm playing also with uh, some friends. Uh, Greenax as Garen, who is gonna lane with me. Uh, Trez as uh, Cartus. And uh, there is uh, Mumuj. As Kai. And Random Olaf. Okay, so you will hear also uh, some people talking. It's because uh, when I re recorded this video, uh, I don't know why, but perhaps recorded uh, the sounds of uh, Skype too. So you will hear my friends talking, like me, and it's French, so don't be afraid if you don't understand what they say. Um, so here we are coming with Greenax in our lane, and one thing to know is I really like to to lane with Greenax. He has a stronger end and uh, the the output damage that Ash and Garen can put at level one is just enormous. So it's often that we get first blood or things like that. Just waiting for someone in the bushes like that. Because one thing I didn't spoke about in my first video is uh, the what I call the first crit volley um, You know with Ash, is a uh, her passive. With that, every three seconds, I think, also, uh, her critical chance uh, grows up. For height level one, it's oh, only three percent, but it can go up to eighteen percent every three seconds, I think, at the max level. So, if you just waiting in the bush, you just sure, absolutely sure, that your first attack will be a crit, critical attack. So. If uh, at level 1, when you're doing uh, more than 100 damage at level 1, plus your volley that, do, uh, that does damage, it uh, unsqueezes like, for example, uh, Vega here. <laughs> it will have uh, taken half of, the, half of his life in just one second. Uh, here we failed because uh, I don't know why, but my Ash started auto-attacking creeps before. Uh, maybe because of the Vega capability. Uh, yeah, it's because of Vega uh, abilities that reveals us and the creeps come. And Ash started auto-attacking. So it was a fail, and fail on this one. So here we are. They are pushing you. Uh, they are pushing us back to our tower. And you can see that we are facing Vega and Kogmo. Uh, Kogmo that was pretty new at the time. And um, also there is Israel at me and Annie and uh, Amumu up. 
Vas-y, approche-toi, allez, viens, viens pour Ok, so. We start. We starting to do a little harassment. Yeah, Kogmo has been pushed back ah, putain, very low. Flash. Comment ça, Kogmo, ça a flash? I have my cigarette, so that's why he didn't spoke here. Yeah. Um, yeah, so just a little harassing. As you can see, as my object, I still got my my uh, lens blade and my health potion. Oh yeah, here Kugmo does a really big mistake. He just come in front of, the, of his creep with the life, so just had to do one volley, some attacks, and it was it. So he gave me first blow, obviously. Uh, but that's nice. It's for the gold for me. Yeah, one hit on the tower. That's oh, one thing on taken. <laughs> so here, Curtis at me uh, says he's got his ultimate. And you will see that we will try to combo a little bit with. Uh, uh, voilà. Synchronizing our voilà. ultimates for his kills. If you think there's one who's going to be able to open it, you ult. How many do Vincent for the moment? I should have seen that coming. It's not enormous, but it's going to be able to finish a little filler. Attention, ult de carte, ult de carte, ult de carte. Un allié a été tué. Putain, la vache. Ezreal killed. Olaf from mid. That's nice. That's nice. That's nice for us, but. Nice shot from Ezreal. So I saw Kogmo in the bushes. Throw a volley. Make him go away. The harassment. Oh la la, il est fou ce mec. Once again. Try sometimes people just think they're gonna be allowed to just walk into the bushes without being punished. Well, sometimes you can't, but obviously here against Ash, it's not a good idea. J'ai toujours mon ult hein, si... Enfin, ah non, pas, pas encore. Israël, il fait pas le jeu. Je ne sais pas il n'y a pas de Je ne sais pas si je suis en train de I think I'm saving for my level 6 to be able to throw a hilt, my ultimate, and the volley afterwards. Yeah, I like to do so. Because if you can just throw your ultimate, that cost 150 mana points. It's so really a lot at this. Uh, at level 6, just train all your mana, and if you can't do anything afterwards, it's not worth it. Here, I have enough mana for ultimate and a volley, but 